Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to your favorite channel, PHTLs. In this video, let me share you top 10 free rapid Springer journals without any article processing fees. There is a call for papers in these journals and most of the journals are Scopus Index. So without wasting much time, let us jump onto the journal list. If you are new to this channel, please do hit the subscribe button for upcoming videos. Stay tuned, stay connected. So the first journal in the list is Smart Learning Environments. Here you can see this journal is indexed in Scopus and if you see submission guidelines then here if you jump on to the funding option fees and funding the publication cost for smart learning environments are covered by Beijing normal university so authors do not need to pay any article processing charge so this journal is free you can read about the journal what is what are the aims and scope of this journal what type of articles they are publishing you can check the recent articles published in this journal uh, read the author's guidelines and this journal is yet to get its impact factor so the next journal in the list is phytopathology research is it is published by BMC a part of Springer Nature Journal Group. So here you can see it has recently received its first impact factor 3.9 which is a decent impact factor and if you see the submission guidelines here and jump onto the fees and funding The publication cost for phytopathology research are covered by Chinese Society for Plant Pathology. So authors do not need to pay any article processing charges. You can check the recent articles published in this journal and read the aims and scope, read, read about the journal, what kind of uh, articles they are looking for. This journal is indexed in Scopus, Sci and other reputed indexing platforms. So it has a, a fast rapid review process. The first decision you can receive within 9 days of the submission and within one month your article will be published in this journal. So the impact factor you can see here the impact factor 3.9 so if your research falls under the aims and scope of this journal then please do jump into this journal check the author's guidelines aims and scope and target so the next journal in the list is natural products and bioprospecting here if you can see the natural product and bioprospecting is sponsored by Kunming Institute of Botany, Chinese Academy of Sciences. So authors that so that authors do not need to pay the article processing charge. So this journal is sponsored by this institute. So you can check the latest articles published in this journal and see the aims and scope of this journal before submitting here are some of the aims and scope I had received an email regarding uh, suggesting the journal for natural products so this might be a good journal if it falls under the aims and scope so the next journal in the list is journal of genetic engineering and biotechnology I myself has published two papers in this journal it is really good journal which is not having any article processing fee here you can see 
the journal of genetic engineering and biotechnology is supported through an agreement between Springer Nature and specialized presidential council for education and scientific research government of Egypt so there is no article processing fees so you can check the recent articles published and read the author's guideline read or check the aims and scope of this journal it is indexed in scopus sci and other reputed indexing platform so the it is rapid journal where you will get within one and a half month your article will be evaluated and your results will be out so it is yet to get its impact factor maybe in the coming this year it might get its first impact factor so the next journal in the list cyber security so cyber security if you see the aims and scope here are the list of areas what they are looking for so if you see the indexing platform web of science pubmed etc along with this if you check the submission guidelines and see the fees and funding option the publication cost for cyber security are covered by institute of information engineering cis so authors do not need to pay any article processing fees that is really good so here you can see it is indexed in scopus and it is also listed in ugc care list india if the authors are looking to publish in this it is also listed in ugc care list and it has a re fast review process like first de decision of the manuscript can be received within 11 days whether your article will be further evaluated for review or not so within one and a half month your article will be uh, out with a result whether it is accepted or needs to be revised so the next journal in the list is international journal of anthropology and ethnology so you can see the recent articles published in this journal read the aims and scope of this journal submission if you go to submission guidelines here you can see the fees and funding so this journal is covered by institute of technology and anthropology CASS so authors do not need to pay any article processing fees and if you see the indexing pattern of this journal it is indexed in reputed uh, databases so it is yet to get its first impact factor if your research falls under the aims and scope of this particular journal then you can target here the next journal in the list is published by bmc part of springer nature the title of the journal is food production processing and nutrition based on the title itself we can easily make out that this journal welcomes article related to food production related to food science so if you see the article processing charges the publication cost of food production processing and nutrition are covered by this uh, agriculture academy so authors do not need to pay any article processing charge for their accepted article it is yet to get its first impact factor the review process is really fast within 15 days you will get the first decision of the article and you can also check the indexing pattern here <coughs> indexing pattern by seeing the aims and scope of this journal so if you see the indexing pattern it is indexed in scopus and other reputed indexing platforms so the next journal in the list i am personally targeting um, or submitting this my research into this journal because my research falls under the aims and scope of this journal bulletin of the 
National Research Center. You can see the aims and scope of this journal, read it and you can check the article processing fee is covered by the Presidential Council for Education and Scientific Research Government of Egypt. So authors payable article processing charges do not apply. It is indexed in a reputed indexing platform. It is yet to get its first impact factor. Maybe in the coming days, this year, it may receive its first impact factor. It is having a rapid review process within 22 days of submission. You will get the outcome of the article. So the next journal in the list is Future Journal of Pharmaceutical Sciences. I had received an email for pharmaceutical related journal. So I have a pharmaceutical related journal in this video. So you can check whether your research falls under the aims and scope of this journal. If you see the submission guidelines, make sure you read all the submission guidelines, how to prepare the manuscript, etc. Going on to the article processing fees, even here it is sponsored by Presidential Council for Education and Scientific Research, Government of Egypt. So thank you. We need to acknowledge the Government of Egypt for sponsoring the articles published in these journals. So moving on to the next journal in the list, Built Heritage. It is published by Springer Open Publication and here you can see the aims and scope of the journal. There is an ongoing call as well. The indexing platform if you could see here Scopus and other reputed indexing platforms. Moving on to the submission guidelines if you check the submission guidelines and understand the cost and funding options here. The fees or the cost is covered by Tongji University. I'm sorry if my pronunciation is wrong. So this university is sponsoring for the articles published in this particular journal. So with this, I conclude my video and I will be coming back with more videos in this series, all articles related to uh, free and rapid publishing journals. Thank you. Have a nice time. Good luck for your future endeavors.